So we're going to replace that one with this guy out, out here, which will take the metal beam. When we replace this, we're going to put in, replace it with a metal beam. This treehouse is 25 years old. This one first permitted treehouse, one of the first permitted treehouses in the country, actually. I don't know of any other one that's been permitted before it. All right, well, this treehouse has been up here for 25 years, so starting to get a little soft. This stuff here is punky. All right, see all the bugs in there and stuff? And then this beam that's holding this other one up out here, it's really bad. It shows you how bad this guy is. That beam, we're gonna put a bracket in on this side here. All right, so we're gonna put that bracket in here to support up our new beam, which is gonna come in here. So it's gonna be supported by this tree and we're gonna place this beam and we're replacing that beam with another bracket in here. Okay, you hear this wind? You guys hear that squeaking and the roar of that wind? Well, that's making it, I mean, normally when you wanna switch out a beam in a tree house and, and you're working in the trees, you really don't want it to be windy. But we gotta get this done and it's windy. So let's choreograph it so that we're gonna get this beam up there put it on the scaffolding, get it in place. I'm gonna cut out, I'm gonna cut out the front part, the rotten part of this porch. Then I need to take this sledgehammer and move the beam in to make room for this. Once I get that done, then we need to take the rest of the beam out. Once we get the whole place cleared, then, and that beam cleared from up there, then we're gonna shove this beam underneath. Once we get it underneath, the wind can blow, and if it, if it comes crashing down, it'll crash down on that. But, but the whole thing is, uh, while, we're, while we have the one beam out, and before we get the other one in, uh, hopefully we don't get one of those big gusts like we got earlier today. All right? We'll need to put in an extra boss on this one. Mm -hmm. Hot. Uh, Hot second boss. I'm gonna cut it right here. It's standing right there. <laughs> That's what I'm looking for. Is the right you place to stand. Yeah, cut actually, it. you probably should cut it. I'm gonna knock this out of the way. This is coming out right now. I need this cut out from here to here. Okay. While that's out, while that's coming up, I gotta knock this in. Okay? I gotta get it out of the way. Cut that. guys can start doing that now I gotta put this beam on on here you can start the lift all right you guys lift the beam I'm gonna get this bracket in I can use somebody up here to help me though okay, uh -uh. okay. okay. it's um I'm gonna be able to get this what we're gonna have to do is uh, Fit. I know it doesn't fit. So, oh, oh. Okay. Well, that's one thing. I think I might need to get my big cylinder and uh, 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 push those two apart. And that's not a chain, but I got to spread them. Hydraulic cylinder would work really well. Let's see. Yeah, I could use a. They got to get this up here. I need to be able to spread these apart. We did not put these two GLs in quite the right angle. They're spread out a little bit. So we gotta make an adjustment here. We lined them up, put them in, but, but they didn't go in quite parallel, so they're spread out a little bit. So we gotta make an adjustment to get them started. There, it went moved, yeah. right? Okay, that's good, probably. Okay. So. Okay. Crank, 
crank that up. It's going to take some while to cut some air in it, probably. Slide it over. Fill it up. All right, so we try it. Okay, now let's try fitting it now. Okay. Hold it there. Get a couple more strokes on the pump. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Push it, see if we can yeah, push it off. Yeah, it's settling in. Okay, okay. we're spreading this apart. apart. Okay. A little bit more. Oh, we had it, huh? Okay, get it your end on. Yeah. Okay. All right, so now. We now we it, now we take it apart. Unlo it. Unlo release it. You guys are gonna hold it from there. I'm yep. gonna have to pound it from here. Yep. All right. Heads up from below, man. That pesky cylinder, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Why is is it released? Is that released? Yep. Yeah, it's way released. Ah. There you go. You're gonna lose this. Um, let's see, where's that, where's the, um, pry bar again? How about if I take, if I disconnect the hose a little bit or let the pressure out? No, it's, it, that's, we don't want to have it spilled all over, it's going to do that. The problem is now we've got it spread apart, we got it spread apart here, but now we've got to get this, this ram out of there. It was kind of sticky when we put it in there, and now it doesn't want to release. we got to go over the top of this. Why isn't it collapsing? Okay. Okay, so now the ram's loose. It slips on. Alright, so now pry this up. Now we pry this up. You know, I got a good size pry okay. right here. Okay. You said that way. Okay. Yep. Okay. Okay, it's getting close in there. Alright. Put the nuts on. Put the beam on. Okay. We have to so get that up toss. over that though. Right there, right there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Can we twist it in there? Yeah, we can. Yeah, it'll go in there. Come on. There we go. Okay. Well, okay, well then that, we can cut the back, back out of that though. All right. yeah. So we can, why don't we do that? Well, you can't cut it right from there. You just pick up that beam, bring the beam out, bring the beam away from there some, and jack up that side of the beam. Yeah. How much do I need? I don't need much. Take this guy here. We can jack up the back part and move it in and, and it'll all be lined up. Otherwise, we'll have to move this back up front. But So let's crank her up. I think we've got enough room to pick up the whole side of the house. We're not all the way back. So hopefully we're in the right spot and we can pick this side up enough to uh, slide this beam under. And it's nice that the wind is died down. Okay. Okay, that looks pretty good to me. We're out here just a little, in there just a little, but we got still got room for the tree. That's a wrap. Sweet. Okay, let her down. Okay, that's a wrap. <laughs>